Hi again. Um, one of the interesting things about using the WAMP server is that the WAMP server has this uh, online and offline mode that you'll see here. You have an option to put WAMP online or to put WAMP offline. And I'm just going to show you kind of what that means now. So, when we open up the WAMP server, you can see that we get into the WAMP server, everybody's happy. Uh, with localhost. I can get in a couple of different ways. I can get in lo with localhost. I can go to 127.0.0.1 which happens to be the uh, the localhost IP but I can also access my server by going to the uh, the actual IP address assigned to it. In this case 192.168.0.106 192.168.0.106 so when I hit enter now all of a sudden I get a different response uh, I can get to it so it's not a firewall issue I'm actually getting a forbidden error the reason I'm getting this forbidden error is because the WAMP server is configured to be either online or offline and if it's in offline mode I can only access it through the um, through the local host IP address. So that would be either via the name local host or via the IP address uh, 127.0.0.1. If I want to change that, all I have to do is I go to here and say put online. So I click on my uh, WAMP icon, I click on put online, waits a second, you'll notice that the server turns off for a second and then turns back on. Now, when I refresh this current page, I can now have access to my, uh, my, my web server using this particular number. Um, this will also allow other computers on my network to be able to see this uh, address. We'll take a look at some firewall issues in a, in a later video. Um, if I was to turn this back to offline, so I put it back offline, again you see it go to yellow while it's resetting everything it goes back to green and I refresh again I'll get my forbidden rule uh, kicked into play so that's just a, a little note about how the offline and online modes uh, modes work even in offline mode though I'm still going to be able to go to either 127.0.0.1 or localhost and be able to actually see my web server in action. Okay, so that's it for this video, um, and I'll see you guys again soon.